Selamat datang everybody! Welcome to my tiny kitchen! Today we're gonna make wachik and wachik is a sticky glutinous rice snack from Indonesia. Let's check the ingredients. Lots of pandan leaves, at least three. 400 milliliters of coconut milk. 500 grams of katan rice or sticky rice. 500 grams of gula jawa, that is Japanese sugar. Or 500 grams of palm sugar. I like Japanese sugar better because it's nice and dark and one teaspoon of salt and do not forget a uh, lemongrass. Um, this has soaked for at least three hours in some water and I've washed it until the water gets translucent and then your rice is fine. So now I'm going to add it to the colander of my rice pan. Everything can go in. Then I'm going to add the pandan leaves and really I love pandan you can use lots of pandan leaves that's fine I'm gonna use for this rice amount about three leave something in open in the middle then the um, steam can go into the rice really well and then I've got here my piece of lemongrass and I'm gonna use I'm gonna bruise it like this because then that's good for flavor I'm gonna add half of it the other half I'm gonna add to the coconut milk so now we're gonna pour the hot water in the bottom pan and we're gonna steam this for 35 minutes until your katan rice is done While my rice is steaming, I'm going to make the uh, syrup, the gula jawa syrup, and my coconut milk. And for the gula jawa syrup, I'm going to add a quarter liter of water to this 500 grams of gula jawa. And then I'm going to warm it up really slowly until it becomes a nice and thick syrup. Now we're going to add to the coconut milk a piece of lemongrass. All the salt that makes it really salty but in the end we're gonna mix all the ingredients so that will be fine I'm gonna add the pandan leaves I have left about two and a half and I'm gonna warm this one up too it doesn't need to boil um, just warm it up slowly that all the flavors can go into the coconut milk it has steamed for 35 minutes look and the pandan leaves are still there now we're gonna add it to my big wok and I'm gonna leave all the pandan leaves and the piece of serai of lemongrass and leave it in. Oh, it's nice, it smells so good. I love cotton rice. You leave it in like this and then my sugar is done also. I'm gonna add the sugar, but I'm gonna sift it a little bit because you never know with these chunks of gula java what's in it and then my warmed up coconut milk and also with the pandan leaves and the salt I'm gonna leave all the leaves and the lemongrass again in the mix just for now and I'm gonna scoop this through and it's nice and wet and it needs to become sticky and not so wet of course but I'm gonna leave it like this I'm gonna cover it up for about 15 minutes to 20 now let's check how the watchik looks you see it's nice and thick and everything is sucked up into the rice now we're gonna warm it up and make it more dry and then we're gonna add it to the mold and I'm gonna scoop it through until most of the moist is gone and in the meantime I'm gonna take out the herbs but for now it's nice that they are still there you see after about 20 minutes this is what your watch it looks like it is really thick it is quite difficult to work through look it's really it, <laughs> it has difficult 
difficulty to come off your spoon. That's good. That's exactly what we want. I've a baking tin here. And I've lined it with uh, parchment paper. And now I'm going to fit it up. And I'm going to leave it like this for an hour, I think, on the counter. About an hour. And when it's cooled down, I um, pop it into the freezer for about 45 minutes to an hour and then it's easy to cut but that's for later first this is it let's cool down your wachik I've taken it out of the freezer now so it's pretty frozen but not too much and now I'm gonna take off the parchment paper uh, this part is quite dry so we can flip it over on a new piece of parchment paper and then we're going to peel off the paper. We can, you can leave it like this and let this part dry, but I want to show you how to cut it. And this is what I do. I make these cuts about five in a row. And here you go. A piece of wachik. So cute and what you can do is I think it's beautiful to wrap it into a bit of pandan leaf now you can hold it to eat it and when you want to stock it then uh, you have to pile it up with pieces of parchment paper in between this is how they look when they are separately wrapped and some are with pandan leaf also you do you want to try one yeah. <coughs> she's waiting <laughs> for it right Sweet and sticky. Mm, you like it? Mm -hmm. Good girl. Slow it, my gun.